Like, like how, what else are they gonna do? You know, get them oh. wide open. And, what the oh fuck? Oh my! This? What? Oh, the oh, fuck? Hey, yo. hey, that guy deserves it for that layup package. Holy fuck! How are you can cut right here? I'll be, I'll be the judge of that. It's crazy how I can't even envision the life. Oh, all right. Yo, what is up, you two men today? I got you guys with two back to back red games. Me on my seven foot three post score dropping 2020 games. You'll see in the first game. I'm just trying to kill ah! I did a. I even have a triple double with 10 assists. Now, I'm playing a lot differently than what you're probably used to when it comes to seven foot three centers in the rec. I'm spacing the floor, shooting a lot of jump shots, really just trying to give my teammates space to work. We're out here trying to get levels to get the season rewards. Well, I mean, one specific reward. There's only usually the extra badge point or a core pattern to go for. Some people like to go for the cosmetic rewards, but I do have about 90 vehicles. So I'm not really too interested in getting any more. You can see right here though, man. A seven foot three center can dominate the wreck. The one thing you're going to be worried about playing on a bigger build is the speed and if they can shoot. But if you can shoot, then that's no problem at all. And the speed is fine. I mean, it's not like you really have to race down court. You should have people to help you right there. They're always going to drop off the corner if you're in the corner. No center wants to pay attention to the three-point line. So that is going to be free threes for you all day. You see, I got super hard fouled right there. The Bob Coosley layup right here. Yeah. Shoot it. From oh, fade. God, that was me. Oh, oh, no. Talk outer zip it. Zeke with the demon front fade, but as you can see, as the first half ends, already 14 points, 8 rebounds, 4 assists. That's a pretty decent stat line, even for a whole game, you know. As a center, though, it is your job to put up the stats. I need to score points. I need to get rebounds. I mean, there's no world where I can just have, like, 4 points, 4 rebounds. My teammates are trying to be out on the fast break. So they can shoot shots like that. I mean, the devious <laughs> oh. dunk in transition by Otter. He gets a steal. I got you, Tonic. I got you. Got you. I missed. Psych! Come on. <laughs> I'm catching the ball. I'm doing step backs. I'm getting offensive rebounds off miss dunks. Doing it again. He pulls out right there, though. So I am looking for the cut. Laker gets the dunk meter to go i'm just grabbing every single board i'm not even sure why iq is down here i'm just stealing all of his rebounds but it does go a long way having somebody else on the team that'll help you when you're a center and people are just leaving you to fight for boards 1v3 it does get pretty tough i can't do any people talking at once <laughs> Wait, what? I mean, you see the anchor going absolutely crazy right there to make him miss. Another offensive rebound, stepping it back. My favorite thing to do when you are a center getting offensive rebounds, maybe the best play isn't always to go up with the close shot contested mash. Now, that is an effective shot, I will say. Don't be afraid to take that shot, especially if you got smaller defenders. But as you can see, I do like to shoot some post fades, some step back, space creator shots. I even get some perimeter contests, which, you know, again, that could be a weakness of a super tall center. Maybe they're not that great at contesting the perimeter, but you got such a long wingspan. You can definitely make it happen. And you see, man, as the first game ends, I have 22 points, 21 rebounds, and 10 assists. Doing it all for my team. Getting that A+, plus so I can get the maximum amount of season level and you see man hitting that big level 39 going into the next game it is more of the same getting rebounds throwing the fast break you know it's usually a pretty consistent way to score buckets now sometimes teams will get back especially when they're squatted up you can't throw the fast break every single time but i'm not going to lie whenever i am playing wreck i do like to risk it right there lob fails zeke doesn't end up cashing the shot out and you're gonna see this ends up being a pretty close game so every shot Every play, every turnover, it's going to matter quite a lot. Getting boards like that, they get a nice contest. Laker out on the fast break. He ends up missing it, but check this out. I get the rebound on one end all the way to the other end. I go into the hoop. They end up fouling. You're going to see the guy starts messaging me. It was me. Oh. <laughs> Give me that shit. Uh, oh, my block. God. 
Oh my god. Snatch block using the pogo stick hall of fame. Absolutely love that badge for tall centers. We're throwing lobs on the other end. I mean, we are. I mean, check this out too. I'm in the paint. I'm going out to the three-point line. You may have thought that was bad spacing, and it probably was, but, you know, ended up getting an open three out of it, so we will. So you got to take that as a win. What what happened? Oh! You see that lane? <laughs> no, guys? I was going to lane. I'll give you that. Basic one spin. Oh no, oh, Zeke! Oh my God. God. No, Zeke! That's the it. shit. Oh, That's no. the shit Zeke is talking about. Nobody would dare <laughs> to do a fucking basic one spin on a seven-three post score. Uh, fucking I mean, thirty-ball handle. Think about it. I mean, it's like drive and do it right. It. Yeah, that. Yeah, that. <laughs> then what? <laughs> uh, I guess then that. Oh yeah, my God! Oh, I would. I mean, you see it, man. Doing spins, 30 ball handle. It's a close game, too. It's not like we're up by 30, we're up by 20, and now I'm starting to do cool stuff. I like to take these shots all game. If we're down, if we're up, if we're playing sweats, no matter what it is right here. Post to green, pro stick only on. I'm always there to help out with these offensive rebounds, especially when I know someone's going for the dunk meter because it's not like I can really get in their way. They're only going to dunk on one person. You can't pull two people into the dunk meter right there. We were playing with a random and unfortunately he wasn't quite hitting all his shots, but it's okay. You see again, get an offensive rebound, go into the post hop shot. They know it's coming. They get a yellow contest, but it's not quite enough to stop it. And you're going to see as the first half of this game ends once again player of the half gotta collect that 100 vc whenever i can get it i got 14 points and 16 rebounds shooting a hundred percent from three men just being the perfect big man everybody wants on their rec team again you know stepping it back after an offensive rebound what more is there to say the messages start coming after that shot i mean he is sick of it i mean he's saying things like you're cheating you must be in the 2k league you know what is going on and i do understand it's not really normal to see somebody what doing stuff like this i'm already down low i got this shit all locked uh, all the way he missed he missed okay zeke you got this hey zeke pull up pull up on no. you oh, no Outer, be oh ready! My he closed that. No, 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 no. Did you not see how he jumped at me? It would have been contested. Oh my God. And you see, man, despite this being a close competitive game, we are still vibing in the party, cracking jokes, having a good time. If you're playing 2K and you're miserable, what are you really playing the game for? And, you know, going even farther than that, if you're doing anything in life and you're miserable doing it, why are you really doing it right there? Laker sees me open in the corner. Shout out to the teammates, man. I mean... There's no point in me being on the three-point line if I'm not going to be hit when I'm open and they're absolutely hitting me. See right there, that was a big three to pretty much seal the game for us. And he messaged me after that, like, you know, he's the one that left me open. I don't know what he's doing. Let me know if you guys enjoyed the video, though. Drop a like, subscribe if you guys are new, if you want to. Let me know if you guys want more right gameplay, man. This is Tonic. I'll catch you guys in the next one. I'm out.